parents are confused and concerned after pictures of Cave Spring High School show a not so clean environment. Yeah, 10 News reporter Arisha Jones is live at the school. She spoke with a parent and took her concerns to district leaders. Arisha, bring us up to date. Well, parents say after those pictures started circulating on social media, they're wondering if their child will be returning to this school in the same condition. They're urging school leaders to make a plan to get the school renovated as quickly as possible. I don't know if it's mold or just mildew or um, I know that I saw a lot of bugs and filth and just bad stuff. That's how Judy Jacobson describes the conditions inside Cave Spring High School. These are pictures making the rounds on social media posted by the president of the parent teacher student organization. It shows several rooms with roaches, wet spots and stains on the carpet and bathroom floors and dirty drains. Jacobson is one of the many upset parents, especially since the planned renovations for the school are on hold after a bid came in $17 million over budget. The faculty is terrific. The kids are terrific. We just need to know that it's a healthy environment for the kids and that we need we need to put some money into where our kids are educated. Jacobson says her youngest child will be returning to the school as a senior in August and she's concerned for the safety of all students. We adopted him from an orphanage in Ukraine and um, he commented the other day that the orphanage was better maintained than his school. He's seen cockroaches, rats, flooding, leaks. School board member Mike Ray says he's aware of the issues and has seen the pictures. He says facilities and operations also know about the problems plaguing the school. They're looking at it and they're going to evaluate, you know, everything, what it is, and, you know, certainly take care of it no matter what it is. As far as the renovations update, there is a closed school board meeting tonight. Mike Ray says there will be a discussion on how to move forward with the single bidder, but he doesn't plan to make a decision tonight. Of course, we'll keep you updated on the plans here for Cave Spring High School. Live in Cave Spring, Arisha Jones, 10 News, working for you.